Hey, what's going on guys? It's, uh, you know, been a while. Um, <laughs> I feel like I've been starting every single video these days with that sentence, but that's just how it is. Um, I did want to record more during the Worldwide Celebration, but things got busy, you guys know the story. Um, but anyways, the reason we're here today is because uh, if I don't use these Worldwide Celebration tickets, basically within the next like 12 hours, uh, I think they just disappear and that would really suck. So we're gonna quickly just go through, uh, let's see, these step ups right here and also use up my 122 uh, worldwide tickets on these two banners. Um, I believe these are all different, so. Uh, yes, these ones are the 20 guaranteed SSR banners, and then these ones are the regular banners. And uh, yeah, with all that said, let's just jump into it. I'll start with the step ups because there's actually a lot of these units uh, in these steps that I could use since I did miss quite a few banners during my extended hiatus. So uh, jumping into step one, uh, I don't actually even know which units are featured on each step, but it doesn't matter. We should be getting a guaranteed Dokkan Fest for each one. And uh, like I said, a lot of them are useful to me. So even if it's like a dupe of a unit that I already have, uh, I'll be able to use that dupe most likely. So here we go. Step one, I believe it's a guaranteed super type Dokkan Fest uh, unit, uh, a category lead that is. Um, yo, <laughs> I'm sure some of the newer players are like, yo, what are you talking about? Of course, it's a category lead. But there was a time when these banners first came out where it was, um, wait, he's not the guarantee, he's not. Wait a sec, oh. Well, I guess technically he has a category lead, but I thought it was gonna be a Dokkan Fest unit. Okay, so. That's my bad. Um, I just looked really dumb there, but that's okay. I'm used to that. <laughs> I'm used to that. I swear it was guaranteed Dokkan Fest for every step and then a guaranteed LR at the end. Maybe there's still the guaranteed LR, but maybe before that it's... Okay, Super Saiyan God, so is that three SSRs? Then it should be. But I don't really know what to believe anymore. So um, just bear with me, guys. Okay, you know what? I've had a very long day. Um, it was my dad's birthday, okay? So I've been running around, buying him a cake, a card, uh, groceries for... I don't have this evil boo, actually, interesting. Um, buying him a card, uh, groceries for his dinner, which was hot pot, really good. But um, yeah, okay, so I guess no guaranteed Dokkan Fest, but we still got a new unit, so that's kind of cool. I don't even know what he does. Uh, Majin Power, okay. Uh, that, oh my god, yo, these passives are getting ridiculous. I'm not gonna read that here, um, but dude, like, I remember the days when passives were literally like two lines, <laughs> okay? And now every single unit, not just the Dokkan Fest, not just the LRs, but like even the, the side banner units are getting these massive paragraphs for their passives, and it's just... It's just kind of crazy. Oh, okay, we got an LR. Now, I do not need him, but it's still kind of cool to get a free LR from a free ticket multi. So cool, there are LRs on this banner. That's good to know. This is our third step. So maybe now we get a guaranteed Oakland Fest. Maybe now we get like a, um, I don't know what I even need. Um, that Tech Vegeta would be kind of cool. Uh, this Go Tanks, actually I don't have. So that's cool. Uh, I do have this Gohan, but I think he's at 79%, so cool. Okay, one new unit, one LR, and also a dupe for a unit I have. So um, looking like no guaranteed Dokkan Fest units in general, which I'm fine with. Okay, I was just a little bit overexcited coming in because I was like, yo, I'm gonna get like five new Dokkan Fest category leads. It's gonna be sick. Um, can run some new categories that I couldn't before. And that was not the case. 
So I'm gonna stop talking about the game now because I feel like the more I talk, the dumber I look. And I already look pretty dumb. So <laughs> let's talk about something else. Um, wait, is this, mm, this King Vegeta's new too? Yeah, yeah, that King Vegeta's new for me, I think. Or maybe have a copy. He's definitely a dupe that I could use if, if he's not new. Um, and this the Doria. Mm, I have him, I have him, okay. That's multi. But uh, yeah, guys, um, exciting stuff coming up in the next couple of days. I'm sure you guys are all aware. Sparking Zero. I mean, technically people are already streaming it because if you got the collector's edition or like, I don't know, whatever special edition bundle, uh, you can play it three days early. I did see that. I didn't get that. I did pre-order the regular version, the standard version. So I'm super excited to play that. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be streaming it day one. I think what I wanna do is actually play it by myself, off camera, off stream to just uh, get a feel for it, you know, kinda get into the game a little bit, get a feel for the mechanics. And then, uh, you know, once I have, ooh, okay, these guys are, sorry, not new. I was gonna say new, they're not new, but I do need dupes. So that could be my first dupe or maybe my second, but either way, it's, it's, it's a dupe I could use. So I'm very happy with that. It's free too, so that's awesome. No Dokkan Fest units, but it doesn't matter. It's okay, because those are free summons. Okay, let's go on to, <laughs> let's go on to uh, the 20 SSR guaranteed banners. And Lars, uh, let's start with the super side. Wait, no, hold on. Oh, it's not super and extreme. It's just uh, different units featured. Yeah, okay, so let's start with this one. I actually don't have this Goku or this Piccolo, so both of those will be sick. I also don't have this um, Turles either. I don't have Yamcha, and uh, oh, I don't have this Trunks either. So yeah, lots of stuff we could use for sure. Um, but Sparking Zero, like I said, I think I wanna play it by myself a little bit, and then uh, yeah, after a few days, once I've maybe logged in, <laughs> 10, 15, 20 hours into the game, I might make my triumphant return to streaming. Because as you guys might know, if you don't, then I'm telling you right now, oh, don't no confess unit. Um, it's been, it's been a minute since your boy streamed. I think, I wanna say it's been a minimum of like, six months, uh, possibly longer. Actually, no, more than six months because I think I made my life update video six months ago and I haven't streamed since then. But before that, I also didn't stream for a very long time. So uh, another Dokkan Fest, um, rainbowed, but it's fine. Uh, okay, Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, rainbowed. Uh, but yeah, no, it's okay. Gamma 2 is not, wait. He could be, he could be rainbowed. Uh, we'll see, either way, good units are around. Uh, Ultimate Gohan obviously is done. Um, so yeah, it would be a pretty big deal. I'm honestly a bit nervous about streaming again, um, not only for the fact that it's just been a while, but also for the fact that uh, I completely, another Gamma too, wow. Um, I really hope he's not rainbowed at this point. Um, he's definitely done. Uh, but yeah, also I completely tore down, why another Piccolo? Completely tore down my streaming setup, so I have to put in a lot of work to get that going again. This guy's rainbowed. Um, so it's gonna be, it, it, it's gonna be some effort. I gotta put in some effort for that, so. Uh, not looking forward to that, but uh, definitely looking forward to being able to interact with you guys again. I think that's gonna be super fun. So out of the um, out of the 20 guaranteed SSRs for that first banner, we got, ooh, Fusion, very nice. Uh, we got, wow, okay. We're getting an LR, very cool. Um, we got one, maybe, maybe one unit I could use. So that's cool. Now hopefully we get more than one on this multi. I'm kind of curious about what the LR is. Probably not gonna be something I could use, but if it is, that'd be sick. So let's see. 
So yeah, sparking zero stream. I don't give you guys too much hope. Wow, a Janemba just caught his Extreme Z Awakening and been rainbowed for a very long time. So, <sighs> unfortunate, unfortunate. Um, but possibly sparking zero stream. I don't want to give you guys too much hope because there's a chance that I just uh, don't need this Broly. Um, I just, uh, oh, I definitely need this Goku. Definitely need this Goku. That's amazing. Okay, best pull so far. Best pull so far. Don't need cooler, but good unit still, in my opinion. Oh, another fake out. LR? Oh, don't need this kick Goku either. Hmm. But we are getting a lot of Dokkan Fest units, so that's cool. Don't need him. Okay, is that the last? No, there's more. Uh, Pycon? I feel like he's rainbowed, but he could be at 90%. He could be at 90%. Another metal cooler. All right. Anything else? Uh, don't need Gohan. I mean, it hurts my heart to say, like, you know, these are all great units. Oh, I do need these guys. Um, the Goku slash Vegeta. It's the exchange unit, right? Yeah, I do need him. Don't need him. It really hurts my heart to see, because, like, there are so many good units here, right? So many great Dokkan Fest units. I just kind of wailed out earlier on in my Dokkan career, so I have a lot of these guys rainbowed, right? But these days, I'm no longer a whale, so at this point, like any, you know, new Dokkan Fest from the last year or two, uh, I'll most likely have a use for. So hopefully that starts happening soon, but uh, let me just lock this boy up. That's definitely a really good pull for me. Otherwise, uh, yeah, this guy's good, and everyone, everything else I think is just um, just extra dupes at this point. Okay, so got those done. Uh, is there anything else we could do before I go? Um, oh, of course, we have the extra tickets as well. Okay, so let's do seven and seven, or sorry, seven multis. No, it's gonna be six multis with seven tickets each. And um, I completely forgot about what I was saying now, but it's fine. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm sure it wasn't anything important. Uh, let's quickly talk about what I've been up to these days outside of work. Um, oh, wow. Okay, another LR. And uh, this is the Team Universe 7 LR, if my memory serves me correct. And uh, I definitely could use dupes for them because I think they're only at like 69% at best, maybe 55. So that's actually a really big pull for me. Yeah, that's great, that's great, okay. Um, yeah, no, I've just been uh, watching a lot of sports. Uh, if you guys don't know, I am a big sports fan, especially basketball, but I've been watching, you know, a bunch of different things. Uh, baseball is in the playoffs now, so been watching some playoff baseball, uh, been watching um, actually quite a bit of tennis because I recently started playing tennis like more seriously like I used to play very casually here and there with friends but these days I've been playing more consistently even got my own racket I was just borrowing friends rackets before so uh, yeah I've been getting into tennis quite a bit that's been a lot of fun uh, so I've been watching like the you know various opens <laughs> US Open China Open uh, you know, all the big tournaments, I guess, with the big names. And uh, that's been a lot of fun. I've uh, been watching some hockey, because hockey just came back. Actually, literally today, literally today, the NHL season uh, just opened. So, yeah, enjoy hockey too. Not as much as some of the other sports, but I still enjoy watching it. Um, football, of course, been watching football. So, uh, oh, also the UFC. Um, I love watching MMA, mostly UFC, sometimes some other smaller promotions, but uh, yeah, just I, I watch everything basically. <laughs> I basically watch everything. Boxing too. Pretty excited for that fight this uh, weekend with, um, I don't know how to say his name properly to be honest. Is it Perturbiev or Better Biev? Better Beev? Not sure. But him versus Bibble, that's going to be a really big fight. Um, I'm actually rooting for, even though I, I can't say his name properly. Uh, I'm rooting for better, I'm gonna say better Biev, better Biev, because he's actually 
part Canadian. Oh! Sorry, when I said part Canadian, I meant he's a Canadian citizen. <laughs> um, so yeah, I hope he wins, and he's also a sick fighter. Um, wow. I'm dumb, because I was under the impression that it was different tickets for each banner, which I don't know why I thought that, because obviously I was using the same tickets for, you know, these banners before. So uh, basically I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I was like, yo, we can do six multis, because it's going to be 21 tickets per banner. But no, it's actually just 21 tickets in total for the three multis, and I used them all on this banner, so... Um, I guess we're done. But you know what? Before we go, because I'm so dumb, I'm gonna make it up to you guys and do one stone multi on this Vegeta banner. Even though I don't really care about the Vegeta that much, but I just feel like I owe it to you guys to do a stone multi. So we're doing it. Okay, we're, should I do another multi after this? Because I think there's, I think there's like a bonus or Wait, hold on. Let me, let me check what the the one remaining multi thing means. Because I think like you get a guaranteed SSR, like a featured SSR in the next multi, right? Or is it... I don't, oh! Oh, that's sick. Okay, I, I don't even have her. So like, like I said, any new Dokkan Fest unit in the last like year, maybe even two, is actually really, really good for me. So amazing. Okay, we got the 21, um, but yeah, no, I'm actually really happy about that. Like, really, really happy about that. Let me lock her up. And what does this mean? Okay, so after performing two multi-summons, you are guaranteed to recruit one featured SSR character in the next multi-summon up to seven rounds. Okay, so does that mean if I do this one it's gonna be guaranteed featured or is the next one a guaranteed featured? I guess we'll find out. Okay, so let's do, th do this one first and then I'll see what the banner says after we do this one. But I kind of feel like, I kind of feel like it's gonna be the next multi that's the guaranteed featured. Yeah, so that means I have to spend another 50 stones, which would be unfortunate but it is what it is. I'm already this far, so I just might as well just keep going, right? I mean, that's just kind of what I do. That's kind of been my MO from day one. So clearly we didn't get a featured SSR here, so um, I guess this is the featured one. Can we get Vegeta? That'd be kind of cool. Not that I really care about Vegeta that much, but it would still be cool just to get the new unit. I think we should be getting some panties here. Wow, no panties, interesting. Well, it doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean we're not gonna get Vegeta. We're gonna get a featured SSR either way. Uh, oh wow, that is... <laughs> I hope he wasn't, he wasn't the one, because that would be rough. Wow, back to back. Back to... Oh. Wrong Vegeta. Okay, wrong Vegeta. Um, my hope is that it's the final unit that's the featured, guaranteed, guaranteed featured. Um, but, because the first two I don't actually need. So that would be really rough. Uh, oh, Kui was the guaranteed featured. Wow. Wow. I mean, I guess... They didn't, they didn't lie, right? He is featured, but um, he wasn't very high on my priority list for this banner, I'll be honest. But nonetheless, nonetheless, if it wasn't going to be Vegeta, um, I probably wanted 21 the most outside of that. So uh, I, th I, th I think it's a win. Yeah, I'll take, I'll take that as a win. Okay. Um, should I have spent stones on this banner? Probably not, but... You know, it is what it is. It is what it is. So <laughs> guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I uh, just wanted to use my um, use my tickets before they expired because that would have just been a big waste. And I did get some useful, useful things from these tickets. So definitely was uh, worth recording this video and worth uh, doing the summon. So 
Um, yeah, uh, maybe look forward to some streams in the near future. If not, then uh, still gonna be some sporadic videos like this. Hope you guys enjoy these. Hope you guys uh, are just doing awesome in your lives outside of Dokkan and in Dokkan as well, actually. If you're, you know, pulling fire, that's good too. And uh, that's gonna be it for me, guys. Thank you so much for supporting your boy, even through all this inconsistency. You know, I'm definitely not the most consistent um, YouTuber out there, far from it. But uh, I'm still alive, I'll still be around, and uh, yeah. You guys are amazing. As always, if you like today's video, make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.